Hello beautiful people and welcome back to another video. So again, I'm just going to do a quick, quick, quick video guys because Trisha Paytas did a video yesterday about Tati's video. Um, she watched the full video, she did a commentary type style and she said a lot and she did not hold back. You know, this is another um, big YouTuber, she's got about... Um, She's got nearly 5 million um, subscribers and, you know, these people, they are calling each other out. It's crazy. But, yeah, stay tuned, like, comment and subscribe. Okay, so she said a lot of things. She called her, vid she called her video Tatty Dumb as Hell. And she called out a lot of things which had me thinking even more. You know, I did my video on Tatty's... Um, video that she made and my thoughts on it so you guys can go ahead and watch that you know i'm not i don't follow these people religious religiously but i'm not here for it you know i wasn't here for tati's video i found it long as hell i found it boring i found that she just literally cried most of it but her cries were like structured out um and one thing that um one thing that trisha said which i was like Do you know what that's that's so true. She's like, yo, in the midst, she, she, <laughs> she said, in the midst of everything that is going on, you basically want to come and do a video crying about gummy bears. Guys, come on. Like, think about it for a second. And I said this in my last video. I was like, you know what? In the, in the midst of all of this, right? All this is really about is about business. It's about money. It's about status. It's about... It, it that's all it is it's not about friendship it's not about oh this person did that and this person did that no it's about the fact that you didn't get the deal or your deal was messed up and you are not happy about it you know and she said in the midst of everything you've never once come out and supported you know the the movement that we are going through the black lives matter movement you've never once addressed um the pandemic and the reason why th this is important is because now is the time that we need for people with massive platforms as big as as these people have we're talking about they have platforms with millions and millions this is a time where we need these people to speak out and to stand with us and to stand with not only with the you know not only with black people and the black lives matter because you know i'm not making this about everything needs to be about black people but about people that have lost job during the pandemic during the crisis but she's coming on camera crying about gummy bears you know even nikki tutorials whether people are saying that, you know, some people are jumping on the bandwagon or whatever. But these are beauty gurus. This is their field. This is their sector. This is their domain. So they have a massive influence over this, these areas. She, even Nikki got involved. You know, she did a, a makeup video just using black owned brands. She addressed certain issues. She's been... Tat has been off YouTube now for, I think, about six months she's not posted. And she decides to come and post a video about this. It's a bit random. In the midst of everything that's going on, this is the first video you come back doing. Like, why? It's a bit suspicious, you know? People are just doing videos, leaving YouTube, doing videos, exposing one another. It's literally like they are all coming against each other. Out, I think... Is out of fear. They are doing this because they know that they hold things against each other. And another thing that Trisha pointed out, she was like, you know, Tati was like, oh, um, you know, you shouldn't hold things against um, people referring to Jeffree Star. But yet, near the end of the video, she's like, you know, I have some things that I can't release. But, um, you know, due to legal reasons, but when the time is right, it's like, babe, <laughs> what are you saying? You're contradicting yourself. Guys, if you want to go and watch that video, go and watch it. It's very juicy. I'll probably link it below this video. You know, a lot of people were saying that, you know, sometimes with Trisha's videos, they're a bit psychotic. They're a bit trashy. I'm not going to lie. I went through some of her videos. But this is the one time where she actually made a little bit of sense. 
she actually made a little bit of sense a lot of sense actually you know and she was saying that she she's not that close with Jeffrey and obviously she understand that Shane what Shane has done but you know Shane is like her brother she's not going to turn away her back from it and whatever that's up to you you know if my brother did some crazy stuff I'm not going to turn my back away or if my best friend so I'm not going to expect her to do that like no but you know address it and speak what call a spade a spade don't sugarcoat anything don't hide anything don't don't do none of that stuff if my friend done some crazy stuff i would still call them out and i would still say what you done is crazy and another thing that she said that tati did which i mentioned in my video that i didn't understand about her being forced to um forced to do the video against james charles because she was scared that he was going to get exposed. So she decided to expose him. Hello guys, did you listen to that part? Who does that? Ugh. Anyways, the video was juicy. Go ahead and watch it. Thank you for listening. And for those that are like, oh my god, I feel sorry for Tati. If you watch that video very carefully. And I'm speaking from an unbiased um, opinion. You know, I'm, I'm neither for these people. I don't even follow these people like that. I don't even follow these people like that. So I don't have no sides. Let me just make that clear. No sides. This is just me picking out and reading between the lines. And make sure you go and watch the video that I made on Tati because it was pretty juicy too. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching guys and I'm going to leave it there. Please do hit that subscribe button. I'm really trying to get to that 1k and I'm putting in the hard work. But I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye bye. Mwah.